Hey, it's Tom here, and welcome back to Dead Cells. We're getting straight back into the run. If you're watching this on Christmas, Merry Christmas, or whatever holiday you celebrate, it doesn't matter. My keyboard has just turned off. No, it hasn't. It's just changed to the Dead Cells layer, even though I'm using a controller. Anyway, we are a fair amount into the run. We're not doing too bad, so let's just pump that up. Let's get going. I did a few practice runs on Xbox, and I beat the game again. So, this is on PC, for those that didn't know. But, um... Yeah, I'm feeling pretty confident we've got a better setup on here than I had on the uh, the Xbox version, so... Wait, what is this? What the hell? What is this? Oh yeah, okay, I can't go this way. Wait, Stilt... Stilt Village? Did I go a different way? One's... Wait a minute. Wait a bloody minute. Oh, it's this. Why is it... Oh, they changed the name. I was thinking it was called The Field, but that's what it used to be called. Never mind. Right, yeah, we've got the Brawl we've got the, uh, what is it called? The Sinu. I always forget what it's called. The Sinu Slicer. We've got that. We're pretty much good to go. We've got 3,000 health. It's all looking pretty good. We've got the Broodsword. Absolute shitloads of damage. We're good. We're good to go. He says, whilst very nearly dying... Holy shit. Oh, you've got a bow. What am I doing? Oh. Ah. Holy fuck. Freeze. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay. We're fine. I wasn't panicking. You were panicking. All right. If you think I was panicking, you're wrong. That was just my strategy all along. If the enemies think I'm panicking, they'll play less effectively. Why did it just make that noise? Oh, the chest. Jesus, okay. I'm not doing the best. After, you know, giving it the larger. Oh, yes, I did a practice run. Now I'm doing pretty bad, but whatever. Okay, quite the upgrade. And we can make that a plus as well. I will definitely take that. So, we need the key, which is here. I always forget if there's one or two keys for this place. I think it's one, but I might be wrong. Okay, the broadsword... No, I can't get back up there. The broadsword's kind of slow. But luckily I have, you know, pretty decent infantry bow. Even better one now. Right, there's one key. Like I said, I don't know if there's one or two. I always forget. We'll get there eventually. Also, I just I just didn't even mention because I was, you know, saying about the whole Christmas thing. But this is a new update. They added some new stuff. I don't think we'll be able to get it in this run. But yeah, they've, they've done a new update. They've added like a frost shield, uh, a frost ability, like some a new skin, like a Santa skin. Like they've added a, a bunch of stuff, did some balancing. So technically, this is a new update. Probably the last update of the year, I'd imagine, because the next one is the big one. Oh, shit. Because the next one is the big one. There we go. Uh, next year, so... It's weird to say next year and it's actually only like a few days away. <laughs> like a week. But uh, yeah, this will be the, the last update of the year, I imagine. And then we get the, the big DLC next year. Which I'm definitely looking forward to. I feel like I picked a good time to get back into this, you know. Oh, shit. New updates coming out. You know, small ones and a really big one. It's looking like... Looking like a good time to get back into it. Uh, let's go for this. Oh my god. I feel like there's so many of the maggot dudes. No, jump. Oh, I rolled the wrong way. It's fine. Plenty of health. There we go. <laughs> The broadsword is a little bit slow, I won't lie. I'm not going to sit here and pretend it's perfect. It's not terrible, but it is kind of slow. It makes up for it with big boy damage. I've also just remembered... Oh my god. Oh, there's so many. Oh, holy really shit. I've also just remembered... That uh, you can roll... Oh my god, there's so many. There we go. <laughs> you can roll and do different hits after the rolls. 
if that makes any sense. You know what I mean. Uh, right, have we gone past any other keys? No. There is a scroll of power up there, though, apparently. That's why you always check the map. You never know what you might miss. Alright, we're going to probably just go for... We'll go for this because it gives us the most HP. Because obviously, health is exponential. The more you have, the more you get. Where is this? A chest? You know, I'll take a chest. Why not? Oh, hello. Tiny red man. Why are there little red men everywhere? They're not men, but... Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh, this is bad. Ugh. And the oh, they've come back. They've come back. There we go. He's dead. <laughs> Holy shit! Uh, get gold as well as the cell damage. Oh yeah, that's better. I'll take it. And we get seven hundred gold for the old one. <laughs> oh god. Holy shit! I'm not doing great. I won't lie. Oh. This stain here. Is that of urine or bile? Probably a mixture of the two. Nice. It's just what I wanted. Treatment administered to the latest volunteers seems to be reducing results. They are still coughing, but they are vomiting much less. Or less blood in any case. Am I on the right track? Probably. Random person. Oh, okay. So, Broadsword 4, 940. So it's the next level up, but it's not a plus, but we can upgrade it after we've finished. But we have less DPS for the time being, or I can upgrade this from a 2 to a 4, which is 2 levels. It does the same DPS for now until we make it a plus. Uh, you know what? I'll take this. And then we can upgrade that after, and as well, if we can try and like re-roll it, re -roll it to get um, bonus damage on a frozen enemy, that would be like a good synergy to have. Oh, God. Because, you know, we could freeze them, smash them to pieces. It's all good. So, yeah, what is this? Is this just, like, treasure? Like, what is this? Oh, it's a shop. That makes sense. A really? Oh, it's a chef. He's selling kebabs and stuff. Unfortunately, he's charging way too much. <laughs> There's no way I'm spending 6,000. Oh. On a bloody... Please throw the bomb. He threw it the wrong way. God damn it. Oh, okay. There we go. There's the other key. Okay, we'll get that in a second. Let's clear these out first. Ooh, just about. Just about got away from that dude. And I need to pick up my game. There we go. I mean at least the you know, at least the infantry bow is still like two hits. We're not we you know, we're not doing rubbish damage, it's just Getting used to the different speeds of the different weapons. I haven't got a shield, so I can't parry. It's just a little mixture of things, you know? I love how they take full damage from, like, the tiniest little drops. He dropped, like, five foot and took, like, a quarter damage. Uh, let's go for... What level is purple? Let's go for purple, because we can level that will level up our grenade and our sinew slicer. Um, I've got both keys, right? Well, I've already used one, so... We only need one more. There we go, we're done. Have I missed anything big? Surprisingly, no. Alright, to the clock tower. I don't know how this is going to go, because this is like a pretty slow weapon. For a bunch of fast dudes. Alright, how many cells? 18. No, oh, yeah, there we go, we get this. Very nice. See, now we can start working towards random melee weapon, which is... Well, can be a really good one. It can also be kind of shitty, but there you go. Uh, let's upgrade this to plus quality. 
It's a lot more damage. And it has plus 20% on criticals. I'll leave that area is. Uh, upgrade this to plus quality. Victims burn when they die. Plus 10% damage when you're near it. And I'll make this plus as well. They burn when they die from an ice grenade. That makes sense. Slow down after four is two times longer. Nice. Alright, we just spent like a lot of money on that. But hopefully, it'll be worth it. Maybe. I mean, I say we didn't have much health. We didn't use any heals just now. Like, we got to half health. We still had two full heals. Well, not full, but, you know, big heals. So, I mean, it wasn't, you know, that much of an issue. We just got to be a bit more careful, you know. Try not to lose so much health. Because, you know, the, the clock tower is the... Uh, is the place where it might happen. Oh, gosh. There we go. <laughs> These dudes drag you around. All right, the infantry bow is good, but... It's got, why are they dropping so much stuff? Hakuto's bow. What the hell is that? <laughs> I want to see what that is. So we're going to try and unlock that, I think. Oh, shit. On my toast. Ooh. Whoa, God. <laughs> We're getting so nervous now. I look down at my health. It's like, oh, they did 500 damage. It's not that bad. I'm thinking they're going to one-shot me. All right. Can we get an early key? What the fuck just happened to that man? <laughs> Oh, I'm out of ammo. Oh, God. I need to really keep an eye on that. Yeah, get shot in the air. Uh, more damage, please. No, no, no. Go down there. Oh. I thought there was something down there for some reason. So far, so good. We've got a shop. What are you selling? Lots of things that I can't afford. Oh, I'd love to get these. Oh, look at the damage. I would love to get these. They're so good. Twin Dagger 7. How much are they? Way more money than I have. Wait, can I drop... Um, can you drop things? If I hold it. No. Alright, I don't think you can drop things. I was going to say I can just purposely drop something and then sell it, but I don't even know if that'd be enough, to be honest. But if I can get enough money to get the Twin Dagger 7, I'm coming back for them because they do a lot more damage than this does. There we go, there's the first key. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. What am I doing? I pressed A instead of... Who knows what I was doing there? Not, I don't know what I was doing, so why would any of you know? Right, let's go back down. And then, to the left. Never mind. We'll hit the hit the bell because I don't know what it does. Oh, have we not been here? Oh, we went. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what this is. Oh, this dude is so annoying. Yeah, I feel like. I like the broadsword. It does a lot, of, you know, a lot of damage, but it is way too slow. Like that third hit, I'm I'm taking damage every time I line up the third hit because it's just this. Oh, I didn't mean to press that. Uh, because it, it, you know, it's just taking so long to actually land that third hit. They have time to hit me. I'm not taking much damage, but over time, you know, I'm taking more damage than I'd want to take, which realistically is, you know, no damage. Oh, okay, we need the bell tower key, which. I do not have. I have the other key. Oh, shit. Oh, nice. Okay, good. Easy thousand right in my pocket. 
Another bell. Don't know what it does. We'll do it anyway. Ugh. Holy shit. Oh, can we not get up there? Oh, no, we need wall jump. Oh, no, we don't. No, we don't. Hello, friend. Nice of you to join us. Oh, my God. Okay. These little bombs. Okay, it's fine. <laughs> All right. Let's go for... You know, let's, let's round this out to 10. And then... The next one we get, we'll do purple. Oh, no, 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 no. You know, let's go up first. Oops. I really need to start just blowing doors up, because then I don't have to keep opening them. Lazy, I know. But, oh, shit. The little bombs, man. They always get me. I don't know how I feel about this run, you know. It could go either way. Could go either way. Mm, yeah, I'm starting to... Starting to feel the speed of the, um... You know. Of the broadsword. Especially against those dudes. Because they're not getting staggered either. Like, if they were getting staggered on the first hit, it wouldn't be an issue, but... Oh, shit. All right, this might be bad. You know what? Let's just freeze him. Get him out of here. Because they're, they're even faster, so... I really don't know these build... I don't know if these even do anything. Oh, shit. If they even do anything. Oh, Christ. What the fuck is happening? Why did that just start flying? What is this? Was that something the enemy was doing? Or is... Uh, I don't know. Enemy that hits you with free... That's pretty good. I'm taking that. It's another thousand. We're actually getting pretty close to being able to afford the um, the twin daggers. So, that might actually be really good. Uh, let's go there. No, what? Let's be... Let's go there. Just that little bit over. Uh, no, we're fine on health. Oh, oh you wanker. There we go. Another another scroll. We'll go for a purple on this one. Upgrade the sinew slicer a little bit. Uh, we should be able to get that. Yep. Come on, come back. Come on. No? Alright. Don't then. Be that way. Be unsociable. Ah, oh, I rolled too early. Okay, I think we need the uh, we need a different key for that one. How do we get to? There's like a, this section here. It doesn't it doesn't look like there's any way to get to the left? Oh, that was wall jumping. I think. Yeah. Okay. No, we can't do that. Uh, that's a locked. There might be something here. Hmm. I don't know. Where are we right now? We're there, which is the end. Yeah, maybe you need wall jumping to get that other key, because that's the only place we haven't been. Uh, but let's go. Let's go back a little bit and go back down for a second. Okay. So if we go, where is it? Yeah, I'm gonna go here and go down. It looks like there's a way to go over to the right, uh, the left even. So we'll give it a little look. Yeah, here we go. Oh, never mind. This might be how you get there. There's a whole nother section. Yep, <laughs> it is. There we go. See, exploring, always good. Uh, let's go for... Wait, I thought our attack was 10. I swear I said, oh, let's even out at 10. Maybe I was just being stupid. Um, let's do... Let's do green. 
And then the next one we'll do. Oh, oh shit! Shit on my toast. Oh, this is a this this could be good. Because, oh my god, if I don't die, this thing here. Oh, oh, never mind. This. I mean, it is good, but I don't. I've never used it. Um. Right. Let me let me kill everything else so I can focus. I'm trying to like go through it in my head and it's like oh, the oh Jesus Christ Holy fuck right, where's this predator We've got some kebab that gives us no health All right, I'll come I'll come back down for the item. We'll have a little look around here first I've right, got another shop where I don't really want anything out of it Holy shit, there's bombs everywhere. See, that last hit does so much damage, but it's just like... There's an invisible dude, I see you. <laughs> yeah, he thought he was invisible. Well, I mean, he was, but I still saw him. I'm, I'm glad I came this way to have a look, because it looked like it was nothing, and then it ended up being a whole area that gives us a big old bunch of health. Oh, here we go. Got a chest up here. Definitely worth it. What is this? Firebrands. Increase your movement speed 5 seconds after killing 100% damage poison targets. Um, What does it do? Oh, you, okay. Mm, nah. No, no, no. Alright, there we go. So that's that explored. Let's go back. If the game lets me. There we go, there. So yeah, these, these items that are like locked off until we kill all the enemies in the clock tower, they're always like pretty good. Where the hell is it? There it is. So it's an L, so it's a 6L. I don't know what that is, this like means, but I'm guessing it's just like a good item. Um, so it frees enemies in front of you, no damage if target is already frozen. See, if we had a free, this is what I'm saying. So if we had like the Sinu Slicer does extra damage to frozen targets or something like that. It would be insane. But it doesn't. Um, let me take it for a second. Let's just have a little look. Okay, yeah, it literally just does that. It's a lot less damage than the bow. And I'm not swapping out the broadsword. So, I think I'm going to recycle it. Which might be a mistake. But, there you go. It's done now. <laughs> so... You can shout at me if you want, but I've made my decision. It's too late. Right, this always seems like it's nothing, but there might be like something in the desk, maybe. Nope. Okay. <laughs> Fine. All right. Well, that's that's it then. That's the clock tower done. We only we spent like a long time here, but we got everything done by the looks of it. So that is very good. Because now I can leave. I still didn't get that key though. Or did I? No. Yeah, I don't know where you get that key from. That's weird. Maybe you get it from a different level or... Oh! Wait, or is that the end? No, that's the end. Okay. I was going to say, oh, I haven't been here. But no, this is just the way out, I think. Or there is an area where you need a certain ability that I don't have yet to get it. Which is more likely. Oh, look at our money. We just... Uh, we don't quite have enough. Oh, that's so annoying. I would have really liked to get the twin daggers. But... I don't think we're going to do it. Oh, well. We'll, we'll try for some rerolls to get some, like... Synergies with, uh, you know, frozen enemies or whatever. Maybe that can get going. But... It's not looking like... We're going to get any more weapons for now. 51. Oh, yeah. Where is that bow? I want to see. Where is it? Mark the enemy who then takes plus 200 DPS 20 seconds. If the enemy dies, the mark spreads. That seems pretty good. Uh, where is random weapon? There we go. Really want to get that on the go. Because that can be so good. Starting with twin daggers or whatever. Uh, right. Let's do... I don't... I'm going to leave that where it is. I want to try to get this to roll with like frozen damage. Yes! 
almost straight away, plus 175 to a frozen target. That is actually so good. Um, let's try and get... That just gave me more crit damage. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll take that. Just straight up crit damage. They explode. Fine. I'll leave there. It is. That's fine. Uh, let's reroll this. It's quite cheap. Slow down after four. Spreads to nearby end. That's pretty good. Yeah, okay. I'll keep these. I don't want to push my luck and accidentally lose like the critical bonuses on the sword. Especially the brutal sword that's like, you know, made for crit damage. But we'll see how this goes. This boss is really fast. And we have like arguably one of the slowest weapons in the game as far as I know. So this might be bad. But we also have the synergy of, you know, the Sinu Slicer does more to frozen targets, which is pretty good. Oh my god, I'm not doing great. Oh, I missed. Ah, he got me. Whatever, I'll just give him a smack in the head while I'm there. Alright, we're halfway, halfway. Whew. It's not actually as bad as I thought it was going to be. I expected it to be, like, a lot. That did not even freeze him. He didn't care. Shit. <laughs> this is getting a little bit out of hand. Really trying to dodge him. There's so much going on. Yes, I got it off. Okay. Oh, he dodged the last one. Bastard. Alright, we're nearly there. We're nearly there. Big hit, big hit, big hit. Got him. Oh, okay. It wasn't that bad. It wasn't that bad. Holy shit. Oh, there we go. Lovely. Alright, what's this? Oh, a new outfit. Nice. Infantry bow 5. Um, no, we don't need that. And we don't need that. Cool. This actually might end up being a three-part episode, which I'm, I apologize for. I did, I did a lot of exploring, which, you know, has ended up making us fairly powerful, rather than just trying to rush through it to get, you know, oh, I don't want it to be too many videos. But like I said in the last one, if I, you know, I could record for like... You know, an hour, but then there's more more chance of the video getting corrupted and then there's no video, so I'd rather be safe than sorry. There we go. We, I almost spent too many just now. Right, there we go. Random starting weapon is always nice. Alright, well, I mean, we might finish it in this episode. It depends. I mean, I might as well, actually. You know, we'll, we'll try and get through the castle. Not, like, really quick, but we'll try to get through the castle and uh, get to the boss. And then if we, we'll, we'll either win or lose at that point, you know. So we might even die in the castle. Who knows? We might be a bit slow. But we'll try our best, eh? Blood Sword 8. Jesus. Oh, look what it's got on it. 175% of frozen targets. We've got a freeze grenade. And if they hit us, they get frozen. I might see about coming and getting that. Because that's almost, what, like triple damage? Quadruple damage almost. Yeah, 100% will be double. So yeah, that's like a lot. A lot of bonus damage on frozen targets. So we, um, we might need to get that. Especially if we can time it where... Because the second and third hits of the broadsword are critical hits, so we could try and time it where we do one hit, two hits, and then throw a gr frozen grenade and hit the final critical with a, uh, you know, with a, all that bonus damage. I mean, that is the good thing about the broadsword. It does, you know, 
it's got such range on it, you can hit multiple enemies at once. With these guys, they're not quite catching us. We're fast enough to finish them off before they can hit us once, so... Well, we can't quite get that, apparently. I'm sure there's a way around, yep. Oh, shit! There we go. <laughs> So if I remember rightly, there's one key per, like, coloured area, so... Oh, that was lucky. Okay. They get you stuck in a vortex and you just cannot get out. So if we go in the blue area, there should be a boss fight that gives us a key. The red area is a boss fight that gives us a key, and then I think there's a yellow one. So the... the, the blah, 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 get my words out. The trick is... I'm dead. I'm not dead, but... Oh, I forgot! We freeze after the first hit! Ah, oh, I should have stayed. That is actually really good because, like, he's going to hit me and freeze and not be able to finish his combo. Uh, yeah, the thing with this this area is that at the end, there's three doors. You only have to open two of them to get to the boss. If you open the third one, though, there's, like, a bunch of, you know, extra materials, items, whatever behind it. So, there we go. What the fuck is malaise? Sorry. What? <laughs> what the fuck's that? Um. Alright, we have a second bar. Does it tell me what malaise is? No. Okay. <laughs> Seems bad. Um. Shit. Okay, I don't know what that is. I'm just like, I don't know what to say about it. I'm really, like, nervous. I don't know what it means. I mean, it doesn't seem to be going up. Maybe it was just the status effect that only that guy puts on us. Because it's not going up from getting hit by other enemies. So maybe it's just the that guy thing. Boom. There we go. Okay. Um, wait, there's a door below us? Oh yeah, cool. <laughs> oh jeez! Alright, focus. <laughs> Don't lose now. Okay, that didn't work. I thought the smackdown would kill him. Hey, there's the red door, good. Oh god, I'm getting blown up. I can't make that jump. Alright, we're taking a fair bit of damage. Jesus. Oh, there's the green door. Okay. We actually got like all of them nearby. Let's go for 12% health. Puts us to the almost 20k, which is like a good amount. It's so good that they freeze when they hit me. Boom, he's dead, okay. There we go. I like that the last hit has a bit of extra range to it as well. That, that helps out. Sorry if I'm not talking much in this last bit. I'm really trying not to die. <laughs> There's a portal there. I mean, I don't know what I'm doing, to be honest, because... Well, first of all, let's go to the shop. Um... Oh, there's a scroll of power I missed there. There's two... How the hell did I miss two? I don't know. Anyway. Let's go to the shop and get the... So it does 649... And then double that, and then... I think it does do more than the broadsword, but only if they're frozen, which actually... I'm kind of thinking about it. Maybe that's not the greatest idea. You know, I'm going to leave it. I'm going to stick with this setup that I've got. Um, where was that scroll there? How did, that, how did I manage to go past two scrolls? Oh, because they're... Okay, that's why. 
That explains it. What game? What the fuck? <laughs> I was clearly clearly pressing down. Uh, let's go for 10% um, more. Ooh. Grab this. Go for this. There we go. Okay, now... So we came out the blue, there's red, there's the green. Alright, so yeah, we've, we've got all the keys, which means we can get the bonus uh, room at the end, which is pretty nice. Let's do the red room first. So the good thing about this, I can come back, go back out of here and go straight into the green room, or just teleport back. Wait, is this straight into the bot? Yes, it is. One gone. Nice, there we go. That was actually really easy. I had more trouble with the first one, especially because it freaked me out of all this malaise bullshit, whatever that is. Okay, they actually down two hits, which is Oh god, that was close. Just want to make sure I'm not missing any, uh, you know. Oh, wow. They actually... It stops him on his first hit, so he can't even get the tornado going. Okay, that's the way out. Yeah, okay. That's fine. Alright, that's actually worked out pretty well. So now we can go straight to the green room. Get the get that key and then just find the exit. And because we've got three keys, we can get the bonus room as well. So that's always a plus. I think I'm just going to have to risk it with this video. Just go to... Ooh. Just go to 45 minutes. And hope for the best. It's going to be really pointless just having like one video just for the boss fight. So, here we go. Oh, can't hit me in the back. Forgot that. That gave us more... Malaise. Alright, we've got enough health. I think we should just go straight to the boss if we can. Uh, let's just go back this way. I'm trying to think where... Oh, it's like a whole different area. Oh. Wait, where the hell is the door? Oh, it's down. I didn't realise it was like a whole separate area. That's fine. Okay, let's... Uh... It's probably up, I would imagine. So let's get up there. Ooh, okay. Great room for a great big painting. The seal of the king's recognizable at the center. As for the rest, spooky skeleton. Oh, that's literally, it's just that. I wonder if there's like a secret if you bring a certain item or something that like activates the room or something weird. Who knows? Who knows? Not me. I'm really worried about this malaise thing because if the boss inflicts that damage... We might be dead because if it if it's like a like a curse kind of deal like in Dark Souls where if it gets to 100% you die, we're probably gonna die if the boss inflicts it because it's already like 50%. Hey, there we go. See two keys and then get a third one. Get a cheeky little extra room. All right, what's the best one? I feel like I should round this off to a 10. And then it gives us 26,000 health. Uh, I'm not gonna use that. So 75% of damage. Stun locks. Uh, crit was 20 victims. Stun lasts longer if a parry is successful. Okay. Um, do I want this or the arrow? You know, I'll keep the arrows actually because uh, I use them to destroy the little flags where it's like. What that does the death countdown that I've been, always been too scared to let countdown. So I'll, I'll keep the bow for now. Yeah, the boss fight shouldn't take longer than five minutes, he says, but hopefully not. All right, 47. Uh, what can we actually get with this? Something a bit... Oh, nothing. Okay. What was it after parrying Amelia? Taxi. That could be pretty good. Um, I guess I'll just go for... 
What do I, what is this? Special, unlock seven more items. You know, let's just unlock cheap stuff to try and unlock all this stuff with uh, padlocks on it. It's the cheapest thing here. Or oh, it would be these. Uh, I'll go for this. This is pretty good. Be a good synergy for a shield. Oh, wait. Too late. I held RB. It was too late. All right. We are, we're not going to need money after this. I mean, uh, you know, we could keep for the next run, but what's the point? Let's, uh... These are working pretty good together right now. Let's see if I can get, like, frozen damage on this. First try. Let's go. Almost 200% damage to frozen targets. Mm, I'm not going to be at max HP during that fight. No point. Okay, well, extra ammo and a bit less crit damage, but more ammo, that will do. And we've got 10,000 left for the next run. But we've got... This does almost 200%, and so does this against frozen people. So, hopefully, it will be a good combination. I'm just worried about the malaise thing, because if this boss inflicts it when you get hit, I can't beat this boss without getting hit. It's just purely not going to happen. But uh, I don't know if this is going to be different, actually. Because I've already done it once. Like, is it going to be the same, or...? Yes, it is. Wait. No, it isn't. No, it isn't. It's different. Alright, now I'm just taking stupid damage. There we go. Alright, alright. We're fine. We're fine. Don't even worry about it. Yes, okay. As long as we can get him with that third hit. That third hit does so much damage. Go, got him. Oh, don't knock me off the edge, you bastard. Holy shit. <laughs> right, it keeps resisting the fucking the freeze, which is not great. Alright, we're getting him, we're getting him, we're getting him. Okay, we're getting him there. Just gotta remember that uh, you can carry on the combo through your rolls. That that seems like the best way to do things. You little wanker! There we go. There we go. So you do one, you roll. Two, you roll. Three, you roll. Okay. One roll. One. Two. Oh, come on. We got this. We got this. It's looking bad. Now it's looking worse. Ooh, okay. Hit him with a third hit. Oh, get out of there. Oh, this can't be the way. No way, man. Come on. No, please. This ain't the one, Chief. I'm dead. No, we were so close. Oh, we were so fucking close. Maybe I should have bought the twin daggers. Oh no, I couldn't afford them. No. Oh shit. My heart is pounding so fast. We were so close, man. Oh, okay. It's fine. It is fine. Okay. I like the broadsword. I'm not great with it, <laughs> apparently, but shit, man. He was literally like 
two combos away from death. I think um, if I had managed to get enough money to afford the twin daggers, I think we would have won because not only are the twin daggers faster, every third hit is a critical hit, which I know every second and third hit with a broadsword are critical hits, but the wind up on the hits is so long, um, whereas the twin daggers is kind of like boom, 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 you know, and that third hit is a critical hit guaranteed every time. So if we, you know, I feel like if we had had the twin daggers, the DPS, like even though the single hit damage is lower than the broadsword, the actual DPS I feel like would have been way, way higher because it hits so much faster, but that third hit still does possibly just as much damage as the broadsword. So, bit of a pain in the ass, but I mean, it wasn't all terrible, you know? We got, that was the last boss, we just didn't quite beat him. You know, if I had dodged a few more attacks and landed a few more attacks, probably would have won. I mean, obviously. But, you know, I feel like that was still a decent run. But that is going to be it for today. It's a good job I didn't split it into three episodes because it would have been disappointing. Although, maybe it would have gone different. Who knows? But there we go. Maybe even the Blood Sword, thinking about it. Maybe even having the Blood Sword would have um, got us the win because that's just as fast or if not maybe a little bit faster than the twin daggers and that makes constant bleed damage on top of the sinew slicer also doing constant bleed he would have had like 20 stacks of bleed at all times on top of taking like almost quadruple damage when he's frozen so anyway hindsight is 2020 there's no point we've lost there's no way to change that we'll, just, we'll do another run we'll get there next time let's see what uh what weapons we got for next time to start with oh good none <laughs> That is bloody wonderful, that is. Wait, double jump. Wait, why is it telling me that? I've always had double jump. Why is it randomly te Who cares? Who knows? Anyway. Next run's going to be interesting because we're not getting... We've been given no swords. Uh, we've got, like, the Spartan kick, the ice, and a shield. So I'll probably take... I don't know. I guess the Spartan kick and a shield. Um, and we'll see how that goes. Hopefully I can get a sword because I feel like the Spartan Kick's not going to be great. But I could be wrong. We'll have to wait and see. But like I say, sorry that we lost. But, you know, it was pretty close. And I give it a good go, I feel like. But the Broadsword, I feel like, for me personally, is a bit too slow. So I'll probably pass up on that uh, in future. Unless uh, it's a, like a really synergized one. Like it has like bonus damage against bleeding. Because then the Sinew Slice is going to make everything bleed. So anyway, I'm rambling on. That is the end of the video. Like I said at the beginning, if you're watching this on Christmas, Merry Christmas, or whatever holiday you celebrate, have a good day. But that is going to be it for me for today. So, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like and leave a comment down below. Subscribe to the channel for more videos. And it's massively appreciated. As always, I'll see you in the next video. And goodbye.